I will find a way to use it because I don't want to waste my money. Point blank, period. So. Welcome back to my channel. I know y'all like, girl, what is your hair doing? What is it doing? I don't know. So this is a old wash and go, y'all. It still has some definition. Um... <laughs> But it's just fat and it's huge and i'm not a big volume person um and i really like definition so i'm just gonna cut it for me so i am gonna show you all how i stretch my wash and go for a couple more days um so i don't feel like washing my hair but i am probably gonna do it in two days so just trying to make this last refresh this for a little bit long longer um so what i'm gonna be doing is i'm gonna section my hair off um, just like I would if I was going to do like a wash and go. From the beginning, all right, so I'm not gonna be taking as small of sections as I normally would. I'm gonna break my back section down into two sections for the most part, as even as I can. So then I'm going to pin that away. And so this is what I'm working with. So what I'm going to go in with, you guys, is just some aloe vera water mixture. Uh, it's probably more water now than it is aloe vera because I just filled it back up so I could with water so I could have some to refresh. So I'm just going to mist this just to reactivate the product um, that's already in my hair. Not going to get my hair soaking wet. I'm just going to missed it some just so i can start to reactivate y'all if y'all can see some of that product that's in there so with it being i don't even know what day it is but i've worked out like three times since i did my hair and three is normally the max for me um but my hair needs a little bit of moisture it could use some more definition but i don't want to put anything any more gel in my hair so the product I'm going to be using, you guys, is, and this may surprise some people, the Texture ID Styling Cream. Um, I've seen a lot of people use this and love it. I'm not a lot of people. Uh, and I say I don't love it, but <laughs> can y'all see how much is in there? Uh, it's not a lot. Not a lot's in there. But I promise you, I don't love this product. There we go. Why is it almost gone? Because I refuse to waste product. Like if I don't like a product like this to use for wash and goes or twist outs, I will find a way to use it because I don't want to waste my money. Point blank, period. So I have decided to use this to refresh wash and goes. Um, and it works perfect for that for me. It may work for you differently. The moral of the story is find a way to use your products if you can. So I'm just going to take a little bit. Y'all know I'm heavy. Is that a little bit to everybody else? Y'all know I'm heavy with the product and I'm gonna warm that up in my hands and I'm just going to rake that product in, really smoothing it in. I'm not really trying to like rub it in. I'm just trying to smooth it into my hair um why did i start using this product for this reason so aside from what i don't like about it i love the moisture it gives if i could take the moisture out of it and add like some definition and hold it would be perfect um but it adds moisture to old wash and go so that's why i use it so if y'all can see now I got a little bit more definition. I've reactivated the gel that was already in my hair, but I've also taken that texture ID and added some moisture. And it also has a little bit of hold to it and definition as well. So I'm just gonna take that second section. And if y'all have seen my wash and go video, y'all know I, I take pretty small sections when I'm actually doing my wash and go. Um, but when I'm refreshing, I'm not as concerned with the smaller sections i just kind of want to reactivate the product and add a little bit more moisture to my hair um so 
I just went in with the aloe vera and water mixture. And then I'm gonna come in with some more of the Texture ID cream. Warm that up in my hands and just smooth that into this section, y'all. Y'all see it, it's trying to come back to life, which is what I wanted. All right, okay. So I'm just gonna continue and then I'll show you guys a side by side of the side that's been refreshed and that hasn't and let y'all see kind of the difference in what I'm working with here. Y'all don't mind this humongous zit on my nose. Something bit me today in between my eyeballs. Like, who does that? What kind of bug? Anyway, back to what y'all came here for. All right, you guys, so I'm finished with this side. I've gone in with a little aloe vera and water mixture, reactivated that old product that was in my hair, and then gone in with the Texture ID cream and smoothed that into my hair. So if we take a look <laughs> at what I was working with versus what I have now, it's gonna just stretch me a few more days, y'all. Um, but y'all see the difference. I'm just gonna do the same thing I did on this side of my hair, on the other side, and I'll be back. So I am finished with the other side. I did the exact same thing on that side that I did on this side. Y'all, that literally just took me maybe eight or eight to 10 minutes. This entire video right now is 12 minutes and 50 seconds uncut. So I just did all that in less than 10 minutes. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna let this air dry. Um, and then I'm going to throw my bonnet on and wake up tomorrow and show you guys what it looks like dried and refreshed. So it's the next day. Um, I've went ahead and kind of laid my edges down a little bit just for the sake of the video, but I pineappled my hair. So the back of my hair is stretched. Um, and if you've seen my other wash and go video, um, I do two big pineapples up top because that stretches the back of my hair and I don't have to do as much stretching. It actually gives me some shape. Um, but this is what it looks like taken down. Refreshed. Um, I let my hair air dry. I wanna say it was completely dry in like an hour and a half. My hair dries really quickly. So um, somebody else, you may wanna diffuse it a little bit because um, I know that texture ID is fairly thick um but my hair soaks up everything so like i said my hair air dried in less than an hour and a half um took my pineapple out fluffed my hair and this is what it looks like y'all just from using the texture id cream to refresh my hair um so what i'm gonna do is just do a little bit of stretching so that i can get a little bit more shape up top so I am just going to be very gentle with this. So I am just going to take this piece here and pin it up. And then I'm just going to stretch this area right here um, so that it's more of a 
uniform shape. Um, what I do to stretch, I'm just gonna put my blow dryer on hot and on high, and I'm not gonna stretch it much because I don't wanna cause any frizz. Um, refresh my wash and go um my wash and go was probably about four or five days old with two or three workouts in between um refreshed and now i can probably get i can get two i could get three or four maybe but i'm only gonna do two because i just need to wash my hair but as you guys can see reactivating that product using a little bit of the texture id for moisture hold and a little bit of definition works perfect for me so if you have any products that you thought were going to work for something and then ended up working for something else let me know in the comments but if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you are not subscribed hit that subscribe button below thanks for watching bye